What's up everybody, today this is my first part tutorial on how to mod Minecraft. Now, this is just how to set up MCP, which is the Minecraft Coder Pack, and uh, later on we'll do more advanced tutorials, say how to make your own block, how to make your own block and have it generated, how to make your own mob, hop da 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 um, but we're going to start off easy and then get a little bit harder as we go. Now, first thing is first, what you're going to need to do is download MCP, which can be found right here. Um, just uh, on this page in the description, scroll down and click download for 1.7.3. Now, if it's 1.8 already, um, chances are this might not work. But if the if it doesn't work, there'll be an annotation or something in the title that says it doesn't work or in the description. But if it's 1.7.3, this should work just fine. Download it, and you'll see a zip um, wherever you saved it. It'll look something like this. Open that up, and just go ahead and extract all of the files. Oh, uh, uh, no, it doesn't want to highlight into a folder. I, I, oh, uh, uh, okay, I will call mine MCP, but you can call it whatever you want. And then all the files will be in here. Um, also, you're going to need to download the Java SE Development Kit, or the JDK for short. Um, that will be in the description. All you have to do is uh, download the one for your system. Um, it's very simple. First of all, if we refresh this page, um, you have to accept the license agreement by clicking that and then download whichever one works for you. Um, if you're on 32-bit, I know it's weird of a w Windows system, you have to download the 86-bit. I don't know why they have a don't have a 32-bit here, but 64-bit won't work for you, but um, 86 will, believe me. All right. Um, now, and if you're kind of wondering if you're on 64 or 32, um, just download the 32 if you don't know. All right. Or you can download 64 and then find out for yourself which one you are, because if it doesn't work, You've just blown five minutes of your life waiting for a download to finish. All right. Anyways, so download that and install it. And then go over to Minecraft.net and click download down here. And then download the server.jar, not the anything else. And why are there so many of these free? Oh, this is something I was downloading earlier. All right. So once you downloaded that, just put that on your desktop as well. All right. And then that's all we have to download. I know there's a whole slew of downloads, but um, it's, you know, um, Java JDK will uh, take the longest. But yeah, download all three of those items, and then we're kind of good to go. First of all, on your MCP, click update dot, uh, update MCP dot bat, and then it'll ask you if you want to update. Just type yes with the capital Y, um, and then it'll start retrieving the files. Any moment now. Okay, now I'm going to go into a quick file here so we can, you know, get all the files on top that we just got. And, um, yeah, so you'll see a whole slew of more files. I don't want to move that anywhere. Um, but all you're going to need to do is go into jars, um, put the Minecraft.jar that you just downloaded in there. Also, go to your um, Minecraft folder by going to Start, Run, and if you're on Windows 7, type Run in the search bar and then click on Run. And, um, Type in percent sign app data percent sign. All right, go into your dot Minecraft. Now your bin and resources folder should be fresh. You can do that by deleting them, then running your game again. Um, if they're not, do that. And uh, if you just want to keep them, if you have any mods installed, just you know make a backup of them and do the same. Um, just and then delete them and all that good stuff. Put the bin and resources into your. Um, actually, let's make a like that um, into your jars folder and then you're good to go there also go into your bin and copy the minecraft.jar and put it in here as well um, so there you go um, it's not rocket science but you know um, once you've done that all we have to do is go back and run decompile dot bat and um, it's gonna do its thing do 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 how did that turn into the Mario song? It just it went off the rails. It did. It did. Okay, I might get fly for cut. No, I'm just kidding. But whatever. Um, it'll be done. There we go. Now it's finally finished, and I've finished making a fool of myself. And now we're good to go modding minecraft now um, that's all we had to do to set it up and in my next tutorial i'll be showing you how to make mods maybe not my next one but it'll be coming soon um so thank you guys for watching um if you did like and if this did help you leave a like and if it didn't help you leave a like if you already knew how to do this leave a like 
if, if you're a living human being, or if you're living in general, leave a like. And, uh, yep, if you haven't subscribed to me already, go ahead and do that as well, and I will see you guys in my next tutorial. Peace.